Here's my do-it-yourself turtle table that I made. It's a three foot by two foot turtle box on top of a coffee table that I bought for uh, pretty much a few bucks at a thrift store here in town. We've got uh, some live plants in there. Got a food dish for them there, a water bowl. Got some lighting here. This is a hood from an aquarium that I'm using for UVB and plant light. <clears throat> and over here I've got this heat lamp. Now you get a bigger one there to uh, project out the heat a little bit wider. It's just the one that I have right now. I need to go pick one up. And there you see my Central American wood turtle hanging out in the corner over there. It likes to hang out over there. It's nice and warm. And then here for the substrate. I have uh, just some natural dirt that I dug up and then on top of that I have uh, some sphagnum moss and some repti bark in there as you can see in the corner there I'll probably spread some more repti bark throughout here shortly I just pretty much got this completed and set up the way that I want it here just in the past few days and let my turtle kind of settle in We've got some live grass here and some other little green plants that came along with the dirt whenever I dug it up. Let them sit in there be natural. A piece of wood that I got this summer. It's been sitting out kind of curing so it won't mold or anything too bad in there. And pretty easy to build. Got to make sure that you polyurethane the wood real well. That way, whenever you mist and put water in here to keep it humid, that uh, it doesn't soak into the wood and warp it, or any of the feces or urate soak into the wood and create molds and things which are not good. You can see here, I've got a little hide I built for him. Made this out of uh, some bricks and a pot that I cracked in half. The bricks create the walls here and the pots on top, the dirt on top of it. The bricks are in there just to make sure that the turtle isn't burrowing through the sides and create this to uh, kind of cave in on them. I seem to like all these plants in here. Gives them nice cover. Uh, wood turtles like this like to bury themselves quite a bit. So there's enough substrate for them to bury himself. Feel comfortable under these plants here. Right over here where he is, it stays in the upper 80s, 90 degrees. Now the rest of it, it probably dips down to uh, the upper 70s. I keep it pretty warm in my apartment with all my tanks and animals. Um, the great turtle I'll have, I'll pick him up here and show you. I'm going to set him right here. He's got a nice color. Real smart turtles, wood turtles are amongst some of the smartest turtle species. This one's very colorful, as you can see here. It's got lots of nice coloration on them. Great eaters. Love all kinds of greens and bugs and all kinds of stuff like that. Pretty easy. Let me give you another angle here kind of alternate this light right now from side to side sitting there because I don't have it set up. I'm probably going to try to hang it from the ceiling and probably uh, that heat light to give the direct heat and light from up above. A little more natural. It's kind of got it functioning right now so I could get this together and this guy in here because I had him in a Rubbermaid container and this is a little bit more space for him. Stretch out his legs a little bit more. What I'm hoping to do here at this water dish is to get a bigger one and maybe make this a nice little swimming area down in here. Uh, that's for the future. It's kind of a turtle table 1.0 for me right now. I'm going to figure it out and get everything uh, lined up a little bit better. It's like my master plan here. Definitely recommend building one of these for any box turtles, wood turtles, tortoises, anything like that. 
gives them light, a lot of nice space to move around. Now I'll be working on uh, up, updating, upgrading the uh, blueprints for this, and then I'm going to stick that on my uh, on my website at bnhturtlesite.weebly.com. And there he is, my Central America wood turtle, hanging out. Probably gonna saw him some greens here in a little bit. Watch him go wild for him. Have any questions or comments? Let me know. I'll try to help you out the best I can. And this is it, my three foot by two foot turtle table. Pretty nice. I don't think I would mind living in it if I was a turtle.